Option in your home, in your home, oh, on the phone, on the phone, all alone, all alone, uh, I didn't see you no interruption. Yo, what is going on, guys? X Super Lobbies here, and today in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to access uh, prohibited sites or uh, no, denied sites on a school laptop or a computer. Um, and before I start this tutorial, I do want to say from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much for 6,000 subscribers. I know that might not seem like a big number to some of you guys, but you know, just for a modding channel and you know, all that support that I've you know received. I really do appreciate. I really do appreciate it. I really do appreciate it. And um, you know, with all the shit that's been going on, and like niggas trying to dox me and swat me and all that shit, like you know, it's been really hard for me to upload videos. But uh, I'm back, you know. So here we go. So first thing you guys are gonna need to do is download Ultra Surf. The link will be in the, the description below. And you're also gonna need a USB. All right, a USB device. This will not work with anything else but a USB. So make sure you have a USB and you've downloaded Ultra Surf. So obviously I'm not on that school computer, but um, like if you were to load up YouTube or Facebook or um, Answers.com or Pornhub or Brazzers or anything on your school computer, it will give you a um thing that says this has been blocked or access denied or light speed, whatever. It's it's a filter, okay? And this, this is how this works. The reason being is because when you go to school, they actually have filters on their IP addresses. So, like, every, like, router and shit, it's filtered so you can access certain sites. So, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to bypass that. So, after you've downloaded UltraSurf, go ahead and start that up. And so, what you guys want to do, you actually want to download. This has to be on your USB. That's where this part comes in because, like, you can't open up these things on your uh, school computer doesn't let you so you have to put it on a flash drive because on school computers if you try to download these pro pro programs it won't let you so that's the good thing about this software it doesn't um you don't need an installation so make sure you um put this on your usb open it up you'll get a gold lock at the bottom of your screen you can put this anywhere just make sure it's hidden so like your teachers don't see it or whatever so i'll just drag it down there you kind of see it but you know not really and um when you first open this up the first time, it's gonna take it would take you to Internet Explorer like it did. X out of that you can use this in any um, thing. So if I were to hit home, it would take me to Internet Explorer. I'll just use Internet Explorer for this tutorial, and I'm gonna go to what's my IP address .com. It's kind of slow though because I'm gonna show you what, what what's going on. So look at this. It's basically a VPN. Okay, you see, it says I live in India. And it's a confirmed proxy server. So the only thing UltraServe is, it's actually a VPN. So you can use this for anything, basically. It's a, it's a VPN. Um, but the reason we need this is because we just need to use a VPN at school so we can bypass these filters. Uh, see, it's confirmed proxy server from Hurricane Electric. And it says I'm from India back here. See, India. Um, so you're wondering, why can I just do this with like a VPN, like Air VPN or Pure VPN or something? Because those need installations and on a school computer you're not allowed to like you know admin your can your computer like install stuff so that's why ultra search is a good program because you don't need to install anything you just start it up like a regular application so after you've done that you can just browse the web like you would do at home and make sure you guys don't um you know let your teachers see this stuff because if like the administration does find out about this it could be easily patched or something like that so please make sure you don't get caught and please make sure like that you're cautious about you know when you use it and stuff like that and a lot of other people might know that like at school they have like spyware on your computer that can monitor that from a teacher's computer using this will actually bypass that as well because when using this you're disconnected from their hub um what i mean by hub is like you're connected through a virtual ip address so using this it makes them impossible to see your screen it'll just say loading for them so I hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And like I said, thank you so much for 6,000 subscribers. I will be doing a setup video soon. I promise you guys that's so much long ago. But I swear I will do it this time. I swear I will do it this time. So stay tuned. Love you guys. Peace.